here's a question I never asked of you. Yes. And, and it just it just popped on me right now. How did that play when you guys went home? What do you mean? In your in your real lives, like did anyone from Memphis or anything or wherever you're living at the time be like, dude, why y'all doing that? Was that ever asked? <laughs> no, of you? it never came up, man. It never came up. They just I'll tell you the story, D Lo, is it's funny that Okay, so uh, Cornette was the one that got us that uh, deal. Uh-huh. Uh, and they sent us money to go get, uh, here, go buy these jackets, go buy these hats, gold tees, uh, you know, rings, whatever. And I, they told me what they wanted me to say and blah, 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 and I wrote the rap. Mm-hmm. Well, I'll tell you this, and this is this is so funny, and I've talked about it on this show before. Uh I wrote the rap. We went up there to uh, the Titans Towers with uh, Jim Johnson. and uh, A musical genius, by the way. Absolutely, man. He was great. He was great. Musical genius. Here was the thing. He told me, you know, what he wanted me to say or whatever, and I wrote it. And uh, we went up there. We recorded it. And then uh, 96... Survivor Series, uh, Vince is uh, standing at the end of the ramp, and he wants to see his new thing or whatever. And uh, Jim Johnson had given us a uh, cassette tape. You know, when we came up there and recorded it, he gave us a uh, cassette tape, and me and Jamie, you know, it was kind of like Run DMC. We pitched it back and forth, you know, with the lyrics and whatnot. And uh, so it was, we are the nation of domination. Mm-hmm. And then it was supposed to go with the lyrics. <laughs> well, Vince is standing down at the bottom of the ramp, and it was, we are the nation of domination. Doom. And we start singing, and then all of a sudden, we are the nation. It kicks in again. And we're like, oh, shit, that's not how it's supposed to go. You know, it's supposed to be, you know, a few more minutes before it kicks in. And so Vince was like, what the fuck? What the fuck? So we had to, uh, on the fly, uh, fix it. And you know, uh, D-Lo, that uh, Jamie is not the most uh, lyrically inclined person in the world. So I had to fix it right there in front of Vince. And that's kind of a funny story. <laughs> How long did it take you to write the nation rap? Uh, a couple of days, probably. A couple of days. See, now this is where I get... I get interested. Where did the, I, I get you were given the idea of what to say, but where did the words come from? Like, how did you marry that? Because I love the creative, I can't write a rap, I, but I love the creative genius behind it. Yeah. So where, uh, where, did, where did those words come from? Man, honestly, uh, they just told me, this is kind of what you uh, need to say or whatever. And my thing was, because I knew they weren't going to put our name, it, and you know, I feel like this is special. I put my name and Jamie's name in the thing. In the song, yeah. J.C. Ice and Wolfie D, you know what I mean? Yep. And they did not, they, they were not, hey, say this or whatever, but I made sure to put that in there. So, yeah. And then no, no, and here's, I, I here's the that's, other that's thing. A true, that's the true artist there is to, 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 to sign your work. And that was yeah, the way of signing exactly. your work. But the thing is, here, here's the other thing. I'll tell you on this, and I've said this on a couple of other of my shows. Uh, they put, okay, so in that time period, there was the Stone Cold, you know, they got the WWE, the music or whatever. Mm-hmm. Nation music uh, was on that. Overseas, they had our voices in it. On the U.S. shit, they didn't. So in yeah. like... I don't know, 1998 or something, I figured this out. And so, yeah, you can't go, uh, you know, you know, sue Vince or whatever. But, yeah, they did it on purpose. They took our voices out in the U.S. Uh, mm-hmm. shit. And then uh, in the overseas version, they had our, our voices in it. So, whatever. I was always mad that I never got a, um, a verse because, you know, you know, Farouk had a burst, and Crush had a burst, and Sabu had a burst. <laughs> and I was like, I was like, golly, can D-Lo get a burst in this? I don't know what you'd say, but I wish D-Lo would get a burst in this. <laughs> I would have put you in, man. I absolutely would put you in. I swear, man. And, and, and 
I swear, when we showed up, I thought, you know, because we knew you from, uh, you know, Smoky Mountain or whatever. Did you know those other guys? You you knew uh, Clarence, I guess. No, Did I, you know the no, other guys? Clarence, Clarence, er, that was all met in wrestling. Clarence and all his boys were all met there because Clarence was just a fan who somehow worked his way in mm. to getting that spot. So I yeah. had never met Clarence before. Um now, Clarence and I have subsequently become friends, and we're still friends to this day. Yeah. But before then, no. Nope. That's funny, man. I mean, I, you know, because we show up, and like I said, I think I said this earlier, it's just like, I knew D'Lo. I, I knew, you know, me and Jamie, whatever, but I didn't know the other guys in suits. So who was going to do this and who was going to do that? And, you know, well, what if, I mean? you, if, you, if you really want to get a little deep, all those guys in suits were Clarence Mason's fraternity brothers, and he would just really? find them in every at whatever city we were in. He'd find a local chapter of his fraternity, and he would say, "I need four or five brothers," and that's how it happened. That's funny. That's how he would get different nation members in each city that that Raw was being taped in. When did it come to you that me and Jamie were probably like, "Oh, they're going to get rid of him." It never came before. It was after the fact. It was, it was showed up at TV and well, Jamie Wolfie ain't here no more. Damn! <laughs> like I, I had no foreknowledge. Like it was kind of like I always thought because of your connections with Lawler, you guys would be okay. Yeah. Because you know wrestling, it's about connections. It's about people right. who, who help right. take care of you. Right. Um, I always thought because you connect with Lawler, you guys would be okay. Right. Uh, it was it was literally the TV I came into after you guys have been let go. It was all right, Jamie Wolfie aren't here anymore. We got to we got to pivot the nation this way. Yeah. And and then and the, do you, you know, remember I, that? Do you remember that where uh, it was right after WrestleMania? They made us do the mm -hmm. thing with the Road Warriors, and me and Jamie said fuck it, and we told uh, you know the Road Warriors. I mean, which were good friends of ours, and we were like fuck it. And they were like, yeah, we get it. So we ran outside and we packed our bags. <laughs> we were not going to do it. Do you remember that night? I I no, I don't remember that. Were you, go, you were supposed to get, like, run over by the Road Warriors? They're yeah, break yeah, you. yeah. You know what? Yeah, no, and I mean, we were like, like fuck it. And so I do remember, so I we do remember that. Like, you, yes. Yeah, they were going to steamroll you. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, and we went to the car. And uh, Jim uh, Ross and, and Shawn Michaels chased us out to the car. And they're like, uh, hey, we'll give you this money. We'll do this. We'll do that. Come in here and do this and do that. And we're like, whatever, man. I know what y'all are doing. And it was a thing where uh, Candido, because at the same time, we were working for WWE, ECW and USWA, so like everybody was mad at us. You know what I mean? It was like weird. Mm -hmm. So yeah, kind of a funny thing, but whatever. Who hasn't I done it the I, road? I, with this, I wasn't right? mad. I, I wasn't mad at you. I loved you guys, so it's all it's all good. Yeah, <laughs> we loved you too, man. This has been a James Rock Street production.